I don't know. Oh. More bear traps down here. Guess I'm not as safe as I thought I would be. Okay, well, I think we're good. What? We need the obelisk chest key. Maybe I can get up to the uh, tower now. Unless there's another obelisk that I don't know about. Is this open? No. Um. Option A, there's another obelisk we don't know about. Ah. Uh. I'm out of sticks. That's unfortunate. Cause I've I've lit all of them at the, at this point, I believe. Yeah, that one's that one's lit. Um Knock at the rat. I don't think I can actually. He's got a helmet on, which means he's resistant to uh to bottles. Watch there be one more obelisk in, like, a very odd spot. I mean, there could be an obelisk, like, up high in in the far tower. Or this one somehow is not lit. Let me see. I don't see any, like, obelisky looking things on the parapets. See, does he have something on his feet, the guard? No, he doesn't. I could I could knock him over. You know, it does kind of look like this obelisk might not be lit. Nope, it's lit. That is 100% lit obelisk, all right. Are there any others? No, this one's lit too. I don't know. Well, barring this, that means there's there's some other step. Than I need to do. Luckily, it looks like the candles stay burning. So you probably don't have much to worry about there. Alright. I'm gonna... I don't know. Do we look it up? Or do we just come back, later date, figure it out, then? Oh, wait. Hold on. There's two paths. I took the lower path. There's an upper path here that goes somewhere. Where does this lead? Dark as hell. True of everything. I do have a lantern that I could pull out. Just afraid of using it too much. We're in the armory. Oh boy. Hey, where does this lead me? Oh, we're here. Ain't that helpful? I never, fig I never figured this one out. And that guy is apparently still alerted. Okay, well, shortcuts. Shortcuts are plenty. Now let's go back in the armory and see what I can find. I'm gonna keep the torch off at least until we get back here. Okay, so he's going that way means I can kind of go down. I got spotted. Hmm. 
So I need the armory key to actually make that work. Luckily, they're really slow. Oh, now you equip this slime. Uh... Okay, what's over here? I don't know what that did. Let's give this guy the slip before we go anywhere, particularly. Get a dagger. I really honestly don't think I can murder... I, I don't think I can kill a rat. It'd be hilarious if I could. If I could actually slowly execute the entire population of the prison. And just wander around. It would certainly make my life a lot easier. Why is this game so cute? I don't trust it. It's cute because the character is cute. It's actually kind of sinister. Like, we straight up just got tossed in jail. Uh, for political purposes, effectively. Okay, is he straight up? He is straight up. So we'll just hang back here for a bit. Wait for him to go by. A good thing I saved. Yep. There's one nice thing about this, except for the whole obelisk hollow blue, you're generally not too far away from a save point. Not kill, permanently knock them out. I mean, I knocked a whole barrel full of oil on a guy and he was only out for a little while. Oops. Yeah, the backstory for this game is pretty dark, too. This really is like the uh, grown man's... Uh... Red wall to some degree. What did this lever do? There's a pulley lever. I wonder if I can use it. No, I can't use it, which means I need to send something up or down. Huh. Okay. Well, this, this whole thing is, uh, is bupkis, at least for now. Whatever, whatever the deal is with the obelisks, I can't solve it at this current point in time. Hi. Bye. Yeah, I need to get the rest of the thief set. If I can get the rest of the thief set, I can pretty much just walk past almost anything. Same thing with the guard set, honestly. Either or would be lovely. But yeah, let's just go back, maybe take a nap. Hopefully that'll make it daytime again. Yeah, there, there's definitely something there. there. There's a puzzle that can be solved, but I don't know what it is. There's no time to sleep. What? Well, I guess we're just stuck with it being nighttime. Yeah, I could use the power of the internet, but honestly, I can also just wander around for a while. Well, ah, shoot. Bonk! 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 Fuck! Come on! I'm just gonna let him kill me. I don't want to waste resources just because I got lost. Uh, honestly, we might as well actually just go back this way. Oh, he's right there. Let's not. I guess you really have to aim for their face. I was, like, I was trying to kind of aim it. It wasn't really working. Still don't know what to do about that guy. Okay, well, we'll just wait here for a little while. We do have the slime, we do have some other things, but I think I'm just gonna look around in this area. I know there's a tower that you can go up. And there's a dude up there. I don't remember if it's a rat or a crow or something. Is he... 
Yeah, he's long since given up on us. I don't know why it's still playing the music. Alright. You said you saw something yellow. In one of these areas. And there's grain. I don't think I can take any more grain, though. Uh, we might be bugged for a bit. Guess I might as well restock on bottles as we go by. Oh, was it an owl? It was a something or other. Okay, so I'm gonna go back in here. I'm gonna save. And then can I load game? Just so it's not playing music at me nonstop. Uh, let's see. Quick save. Three seconds ago. Dang it! Uh, I guess I should probably save normally. Maybe I have to get back into combat. And then back out of combat. Now, I want to say I brain this guy, but let's go the other way. We've just saved. So, like, I can be as brave as I want. There's no limited... Limited number of... Saves. Anyway, hello! Oh. This place seems unfortunate. Very unfortunate. I found their pooper. Their pooper sucks. Their pooper is filled with death. Maybe that'll fix it? So I think the only way... Yep, okay, so that fixes the music. I think the only way I'm going to be able to go up into that section is if I have the uh, guard armor. Bonk. That's where I just knocked this guy out. So that that was where we went. This is the other place we have to go. Bonk. This guy's got a handkerchief. Another fate card. Bunch of these. I don't think there's anything else in here. Oh, right. Candles. Worn chest key. Cupboard. Nothing there. Nothing there. Might as well just keep heading up. Guard will be confused as to why he just had blunt force trauma to the head, but, you know, I don't think he's going to figure it out. That's the guy. Yeah, it wasn't an owl. It was that... It was that cloaked hooded rat. He's the one. I'll talk to him in a bit. There's gotta be some things to look at. Well, no, I should probably actually go into his, like... His little house. Bottle of rot gut. I don't actually know what to do with the bottles of rot gut. He might be able to, like, uh, use them as bait? It's been a while. Did I check out the cupboard near the knocked out rat? No, but I'm gonna have to knock him out again. That poor guy is gonna have some hefty Dane Bramage by the time he's like by the time we're done. Ooh, cannonballs. Huh. Ropes. I wonder if I can actually use them to ascend and descend. Be nice if there were vertical shortcuts in this game. I mean mice can climb. Mysterious rat. Why are you hiding your face? You've nothing to fear, Mouse. Not from me. It was you who left me the key. Ah, you seem disappointed. The message was written in Mer Meridian. Why? A precaution. What do you mean? Few of the guards can read at all. None of them can read Mer Meridian. Meridian. The language of mice. Meridian originated in the mouse lands of Mer Meridia, annexed during the War of the Green Flame, and now under the rule of the Red Paw. While not outlawed, it's rare to hear Meridian spoken in public, for all trade is conducted, and official pronouncements made in the common tongue. Still, the language survives in the songs of wandering minstrels and is spoken freely in the remote villages of what was once Northern Meridia. In recent years, the language has seen a resurgence among young mice folk. For them, the use of Meridian is political, a small act of resistance against the ever-present forces of the Red Paw, and the gradual erosion of their culture. But you can. Something I picked up as a pup. Know thy enemy. 
Isn't that what they say? Please, tell me your name. Sing me something. <laughs> Sing something that is that a family name? Very well. Just keep it short. Let's go with the uh, murder of crows. A murder of crows. I've found the true nature of creatures is shown in the names by which each is collectively known. I can't sing. I've heard tidings of magpies and seen murders of crows, smelled a surfeit of skunks with a peg on my nose. Met a mischief of mice who were masters of pros and a sneaking of weasels who were light on their toes. But the rats were the worst, as well everyone knows. Cause a gathering of rats is a plague as it goes. And now, that's off my chest, I'll have this to propose. That there are creatures of whom I'd su suggest we dispose. Wow, I chose the most racist of songs to sing to the guy. You dare sing that to my face, you're braver than you look. That's good. So tell me. Why exactly are you here, Mouse? I think perhaps you already know why. Here. The mysterious stranger hands you a familiar Lutka. Lutkas. Small figurines carved by every mouse buck to commemorate an occasion of his marriage and the birth of his children. Lutkas are made in wood or stone and sustained with lime to, prevent, to represent the living and ash to commemorate the dead. Often carried at the waist in a small purse, Lutkas... Count among a buck's most precious belongings. I believe that's yours. Thank you, yes. Someone f someone you care for. Mara, my wife. I hope she'd be here, but... I saw the blat Lutka in your pouch. Okay. My son. I'm sorry. Truly sorry. Mara, I can help you find her. How? I have my ways. And in return, I need you to get something for me. Sure. Good, I'm Silas. Let's get started. So how intend do you uh how do you intend to find Mara? All arrests and prisoner transfers for the region are uh have to be registered at the nail. Yuva Citadel, the regional headquarters of the Rat Empire, Yuva Citadel dominates what was once the capital city of the Kingdom of Meridia, known colloquially as the Nail. It's from this stronghold that the Rat Guard has brutally suppressed any signs of revolt among the mouse population. It'll take some time to get a message to Yuva. But they'll know where Mara's being held. Yuva Citadel. Okay. Uh, yeah, we've already read that. Fetch me a scat beetle from the cage over there. Scat beetle. Ooh, lore! A horn-flying beetle native to the equi uh, eastern equatorial region. In the wild, the scat beetle lures its prey by mimicking the mating call of other beetles. The signal guards of the Red Paw use this ability to send messages across great distances, encoded as a series of taps. Whistles and clicks that the scat beetle learns and repeats. The bond between the signal guard and his scaps is extremely strong. The beetles have be having been reared from larva by their handler. Okay, scat beetle cage. Cage. Okay, probably this? Beetle cage. I freed all the other ones. What are you planning to do with that bottle? Drown your sorrows? Oh, what? No, it's empty. Pity. Here's the beetle! Is something wrong? I'm afraid the rest of the beetles escaped. Yes, I saw what happened. I just wanted to see if you admit to it. I'm sorry. Anyway, they'll likely not go far. Just keep an eye out for them while you're about in the keep. I will. Now, let's get this message on its way. Holding it between his cup paws, Silas whistles a coded message to the scap, then gently launches the beetle into the air. With a whir of its wings, it is away, heading north for Yuva. Farewell, scap. Fly true. Alright then, what is it that you need of me? Beneath this keep is a warren of ancient tunnels. There's something hidden down there, something I need you to find. Must be something important. Something priceless. You must be exhausted. You should get some sleep. Aye, thank you. Here. Here. The rat hands you a burnished key. Take my cot. I'll keep watch.
Okay, so let's grab some bottles. Need the key to Silas's chest. Drawer. Message, logbook, spyglass, apple core, more bottles. Luckily, the guy does not care too much about me robbing him. I think the bottles respawn. Oh, there's a ladder up above. There's a lot of stuff that you can do. Trap door. Apple. So I think now we can sleep. Oh, that's cool. Oh. Well, that was weird. I flew for a second there. In a weird way. Okay, Foot Locker has... Silas's figurines. Clothes peg. Oh. For smell, probably. Alright. Well, let's sleep until 7 a.m. So now I can actually see stuff. Which is good, because it was freaking dark. Let's get let's get downstairs. So we have to confront Silas about something. He had figurines of his own. I thought he had a map in here. Ah, but he has another another bottle of rocket. Yeah, I was not wrong. Every time you uh you reload. Ah, there's the courtyard map. Every time you reload, uh, or not reload. Every time you sleep, uh, a lot of the bottles and stuff respawn. Which definitely makes my life easier. Good morning, Mouse. Good morning. Are you feeling rested? Do you know I had the strangest dream? Of Mara. I remember you're doing this for her. Now, it's time to get to work. So these tunnels, how do I get to them? It won't be easy. The lower keep was sealed off decades ago when the entrance tunnel collapsed. The tunnels of the lower keep collapsed almost 40 years ago, towards the end of the king, uh, towards the end of King Roderick's reign, when dwindling heights fell under attack of the forces of the ferrets of Seltar. So it collapsed. It's only home to spiders now. Spiders? You didn't mention anything about spiders. I'm sure you can outrun them. Is that a problem? N no, it's fine. Good. A few days ago, one of the sentries disappeared from his post. We found his corpse down in the old armory, cocooned in spider silk. Commander is sending a small squad of five into the catacombs to lay traps and poison. I have orders to join them, but you're going to go in my place. You'll be Private Scow, assigned from Yuva to replace Private Fuel. Alright. You'll need to put together a suit of armor. Disguise yourself as a guard. Go on. There are pieces of old suits stowed away all over. You'll need a helmet that hides your face. Look for a salad. Also, you should prepare an antidote for the spider's venom before you head into the lower keep. Their bite can be lethal. An antidote? I wouldn't know where to begin. Somewhere down in the sewers, there's a rat who should be able to help you. His name's Faustus. I see. Er, Faustus, he's one of the guards? He's a prisoner. A prisoner? Aye, they say he was an apothecarist. Sent here for failing to cure the Baron's ringtail. And ringtail, a disease that carries causes a series of painful constrictions along the length of a rodent's tail. If left untreated, the appendage can turn gangrenous and drop off. And it's a long story. Tors Harum, the guard that patrols the ramparts, he's been chosen as the apothecarist's new assistant. He has a scroll tucked in his belt, with instructions for how to reach this Faustus. How do you know any of this? From, from private Harum's own tongue. The fool is bragging about it in the mess hall. Why would this apothecarist help me? Because you're going to be his new assistant. I don't understand. Why is a prisoner being kept in the sewers? Tilo, it's better that you don't know too much. Uh, how... Oh, all right. Once you have everything you need, I'll give you the commander's orders. They won't let you get through the west gate. Uh, they won't let you get through the west gate to the elevator without them. All right, I suppose I should get started. Godspeed and be careful. I'll not be able to help you if you get caught. The other thing was... Why do you have a mouse's figurines in your footlocker? You went through my possessions. These Lutkas aren't yours. Are they yours? Give them to me. Fine, here. You know what these figurines mean. You shouldn't have taken them. You can trust me. We'll see. Okay. I saw the rope and pull you have set up over by the beetle cages. Aye, I use it to bring up supplies from the garden. You can use it as a shortcut back to the courtyard. Should hold your weight. 
I'll keep that in mind. You don't trust me. Well, there's always the stairs. Forgive me, I have to go. Okay, so we have a rope and pulley system. I gotta go test that. Because I didn't know that was here. Oh, now it's functional. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, look at this. I'm a mouse in a basket. Of course, I have no idea if this is a... Oh, it's here. Oh, that's even more perfect. Look at how convenient this location is. This garden is like my... This garden is my, like, hub. I almost kind of wish I could make, like, a, a base of operations in here. Fortunately, it doesn't look like anything's regrown. Okay. I'm going to go back. Uh, now that we have this shortcut set up, there was an old chest that we just got a key for that I want to go find. Admittedly, I I'm going to have to stop soon. But let's see if I can find that chest before I go anywhere. I really like the writing for this game. I I almost wish that the hint system wasn't so costly. I mean, I guess I could always just cheat. Um, because I'd absolutely love to to be able to like look around some of these, and not look around some of these places, but you know, like uh, have a little bit more guidance. I guess that's what uh, looking up Steam guides are. Steam guides are for. Is this the chest? Nope, nothing in here. There's a fate card and another bottle, but I'm good on bottles. There's also, like, climbing. Oh, beetle eggs. Hmm. I don't think I'm supposed to do anything out here. But yeah, this whole game's about shortcuts and making your life slowly easier. Which I really like. I like this whole thing. Why is the bell on the back of our hat never jingle? I mean, I guess it would get really annoying. But I just realized we have a bell on the, on the back of our hat. And it's like, huh. You'd think that would jingle. Like, a lot. You didn't try and cheat the hint system before you saved and after each pur purchase? Oh, I totally did. Just didn't... I wish I didn't have to. There's no chest in there. Where's this old chest? Oh, there it is. Now, I don't know how bugged this guy is. It'd be hilarious if I actually broke him permanently. Anyway, here's the chest. We've got a thief's belt. What's the 25? Do we level up? Skills. Oh, shit, we do level up. Huh. I wasn't aware. Okay. Well, in that case... Oh, what are these? Oh, using poisons and potions. Okay. Uh, uh... Clothes. So, yeah, we, we have a leveling system. So, the Thief's Belt is actually worse than the Minstrel's Cord. It gives me some, um... It, it gives me some resistances to weapons and falling. But it's not so great. There's also a... Some of these things. Ha. Huh. A wooden peg. It's probably for, for stank. I guess I'm gonna hide in here and save. Whoa. Glitched out a little bit. I like this game. It uh, has issues. Yeah, I think he's bugged. Because he's not moving. He's supposed to move. Okay, now he's moving. Hopefully that'll unbug him. I mean, I guess technically what I should have done was not done any of that, but whatever. It's not like he's of any threat now that we've got this shortcut set up. I have nothing to worry about. Because all I have to do is just, uh... All I have to do is just go straight back down here. See, I think I've checked that guy out. We've got we've got everything there. This is one of those cool games where everything that you see in the uh, on the level you can go to. I really I don't know I I adore games that let you do that. It makes life just so much easier.